Hi friends, Miss Cat from the Wood County District Public Library. Imagine your story is happening this summer. Hope you all got your Connect Magazine colored and cut out your story time crown. If so, go get it. Woo Imagine your story also comes with a reading map and hero missions. Anything you read or listen to from our story videos or on your own and all the hero missions that you complete get you further along in your fairy tale map. And one of the cool things about fairy tales is that we can make changes to them to make them new and interesting. We call some of those fractured fairy tales when they're really, really different from the original. And one of them that I would like to share with you today is Goldie Rocks and the Three Bears. So it already sounds different. Instead of Goldie Locks, like her blonde hair, it's Goldie Rocks, like our rock band. This book is by Corey Rosen Schwartz and Beth Colton and illustrated by Nate Rag. And I would like to thank Penguin Random House for permission to use this book. Look at all those cool rock and roll instruments. We've got drums and a microphone and keyboards and guitars. Goldie Rocks and the Three Bears. Once upon a rock and roll time, three bears in a band jammed with ease. The Papa Bear drummed, the Mama Bear strummed, and Baby Bear tickled the keys. But the band didn't have many fans yet, and Papa Bear figured out why. Though we all love to croon and can carry a tune, we can't hit the notes way up high. So they set out to find a soprano. Soon after they left, a girl knocked. Is that porridge I smell? Gee, that would be swell. She checked and the house was unlocked. A studio! Great balls of fire. Amazed, Goldie raced through the door. She forgot about food and was now in the mood to hurry on in and explore. The mama bear's mic hit her elbow and papa bear's reached the top of her head. But baby bear's was hiked to just where she liked. I'll give it a whirl, Goldie said. She grabbed it and started performing. Oh, doobie wop, dum diddy do. She was singing quite well till she stumbled and fell and the microphone stand broke in two. So Goldie said, I'll try the headphones, but Mama Bear's pair was too tight. The papas were loose. Gee, these are no use, but Baby Bear's fit her just right. That tune was so catchy, thought Goldie. I'd love to be part of their band. The guitar was too twiny. The symbol's too clangy. The piano was perfectly grand. Exhausted from moving and grooving, she needed to catch a few Z's. This day has been a doozy. I'm feeling quite snoozy. She dozed off on Baby Bear's keys. In the meantime, the bears had held tryouts, but none of them blew them away. The hair was too twitchy. The pigs were too pitchy. And Red was just simply okay. Do you see the other fairy and folk tale things? We've got the hare, which could be from the tortoise and the hare story. The three pigs from the three pigs and the big bad wolf. Little Red from Red Riding Hood. That's part of what makes it a fractured fairy tale. That and how different our story goes. Goldie locks, Goldie rocks. She didn't eat porridge or check tables and chairs or beds. She's playing music. The family returned to their cottage, distressed from the lack of success. When they saw the inside, the mama bear cried, Egads, what a terrible mess. Someone's been using my mic stand. Someone's been using mine too. Then baby bear spoke, Oh no, my stand broke. He started to sniffle. Boo hoo. Then Mama Bear looked at her headphones. Oh, someone has tried my pair on. 
Mine too, Papa growled. The parents both scowled, and Baby Bear cried, Mine are gone! Then Papa said, Who's played my drum set? And Mama said, Who plucked my strings? Well, who's in my chair? asked the littlest bear. She's drooling all over my things. They stared at the slumbering blonde girl, and Papa asked, Who could she be? He disrupted her dream. She awoke with a scream. The pitch was a perfect high C. The bears asked to hear a whole medley when once Goldie recovered from shock. Amazing, said Mom. Pop grinned. You're the bomb. And Baby, cur Baby cried, Goldie can rock. Together they wrote a new ditty. They practiced it into the night. And soon their new jingle became a hit single. Too hot, too cold, or just right. Their albums now top all the rock charts. A country ride tour has been planned. The fans scream and shout they're crazy about... Goldie Rocks and the Great Three Bear Band. Let's see if you can write a fairy tale story or find other fractured fairy tales or other versions of fairy tales as you complete your hero missions. <laughs>